My name is Alice Chen. I'm a hospitalist over at UCLA. Um, this is Rob Zach, one of my uh, my buddies. We're actually both physicians who were, uh, who volunteer with a group called Doctors for America. We actually are in support of of the health reform that's going through Congress right now. And I just wanted to make a comment. I mean, I I think it sounds like the, the there's been a lot of sentiment uh, that. I'm sorry, I forgot your name. Marcy. Marcy. Uh, that, that agrees with, with Marcy and, and what you were saying, uh, that the, you know, you don't think HR 3200 is, is the way to go. I just wanted to make a comment that, that it's not just the AMA that has endorsed the, the, the health reform. It's the American Academy of Pediatrics, uh, the American College of Physicians, the Family Physicians, the Society of General Internal Medicine, the American College of Surgeons. There are half a million physicians who are represented by organizations, not including the AMA, that are in favor of reform. Um, and I think some, some of what, 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 was, what was being said in terms of, you know, we, we don't want the government to be involved with, be, we don't want the government to stand between us and our patients. I think a lot of us see that there's insurance companies that are standing between us and our patients. Sure, you can open up. You can open up, you know, interstate commerce. You can tell insurance, you know, you can you can try to fix things that way. But at the end of the day, insurance companies are trying to make money, and so that that is their bo their bottom line is trying to make a profit, and so leaving 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 cost controls and leaving choice in their hands, it hasn't worked to date, and I don't think it's going to work in the future. 